Thank you for joining SportsSessionPlanner.com, the world's premier football session planner. This video aims to give you all the information that you will need to get the best possible use of your membership. After logging in, you'll see the homepage content changes, becoming a personal resource base. Here you'll see a video library with short videos showing you how to get the best from Sports Session Planner. Useful new features are often added, so we recommend you keep an eye on the videos marked new. Below the video library, after you've started viewing sessions, you'll see a favourite section. You can step through any videos you've favourited and return to them with a click. You'll also have a one-click route back to the last several sessions you've visited in the recently viewed section. Looking along the tabs at the top of the screen, you'll find Create Session. This is your direct route to the centerpiece of Sports Session Planner, the Session Editor. We'll use that in a few moments. The next three tabs are libraries to help you quickly find the session you want. My Sessions tab contains all of your own sessions. The list shows your most recently edited sessions first. You can list sessions you've filed in a particular category. or for a particular skill or difficulty level. You can click the thumbnail or read more link to view the complete session or load it back into the session editor to make changes by clicking the edit button. If you're a club member you'll also have club sessions tab. This library shows all the sessions created by coaches in your club which have been shared as club or pu public sessions. Finally, the Library of Everything. The Session Library lists every session available to you. All of your own sessions, all sessions from your Club Sessions Library and all public sessions. One of the powerful ways you can locate a session in the Session Library is with a keyword. You can enter an author's name, Any words from the titles or comments and matching sessions will be listed for you. Linked from each of your libraries is the service most valued by our coaches. With our trademark session builder you can put together a full customized five part session in just a few moments. I'm going to show you how it works. On the left hand side are all the selection controls you need to locate the kind of drills you're looking for. Notice how you can limit the keyword to search only the screen title, the session title, comments and all information about each drill. Below that you can control how much information is displayed about each drill. On the right hand side of the screen you'll see all drills matching your search criteria. There's only so much detail you can get from a thumbnail and titles, so just click the View More link to see the detail of any drill. After you locate each drill you want to use, drag it into the drop zone. You can reorder drills, change your mind and when you're ready click Create Session to load them into the Session Editor. The Session Builder will transfer you now to the 3D Session Creator so that you have the option of modifying your session before you save it. The 3D Session Creator is the most professional and advanced of its type in the world. On the right hand side is a selection of preset pitch views. If you click on the pitch and move your mouse you can rotate the pitch. You can also do this using the controls on the 3D toolbar. On the left hand side is a concertina menu where you can select players, equipment, lines and text and drag them onto the 3D pitch.
Select a player with the position you need and drag him onto the pitch. You can use the zoom in function. Next, rotate the player to the position you require. Then you can click the man in the 3D toolbar to make changes to that specific player. You can make any player transparent to indicate his next movement. If you select a running player then you can click on speed shoot which will give him a shoot that can be useful for fitness drills. You can change the colour of a whole team with the kit designer. You can choose from three kits which are two teams plus the match officials or coaches. Select the equipment that you require and drag it onto the pitch. You can change the colour of any selected equipment by clicking on the colour palette on the 3D toolbar. If your club uses a different line convention then you can edit the line appearance by clicking on the pencil icon to the side of any line. The system will remember your color colouring conventions. To return to the default line convention simply click on reset line styles. To draw a line, click on a line from the library. Then on the pitch, hold down the mouse button while drawing your line. Custom lines allow you to draw freehand. You can select a pitch line to create your own pitch areas. You can lengthen or shorten a highlighted line by dragging the controls on either end or reposition it by dragging it from the middle. When a line is selected an arrow button will appear in the 3D toolbar. Click on this to change the arrow direction. You can drag text and numbers onto the pitch. They will always turn to face you from any viewing angle. Other features on the 3D toolbar are camera angle to view the pitch from different directions. You can change the ground of the pitch. You can change the size of the players and equipment. You can lock the pitch to avoid rotating it accidentally when moving players and equipment. To delete an object, highlight it and simply click on the red cross. When you have completed your drill, you can add comments and use the formatting buttons to make the text bold, italic or underlined. To create another drill, you click the plus button on the tab bar. Double click on the tab to rename the drill. You can also use the same method to give your session a title. If you click on these two buttons then you can use the editor as a presentation tool. You can use the scribble board to highlight movement patterns and you can use it as a presentation aid. When you have completed your session, you will need to save it into your session library. Complete the fields and simply click Save. 
This will then redirect you to your session library. From here you can click on the thumbnail or the read more link to view the session. You have many options on this page. You can save the session as a PDF onto your PC, save as a colour or black and white image, download as a web page which you can publish on your own website, edit or delete your session. Cloning the session will copy it back to the editor to use it as the basis of a new session. This is your main presentation tool. You can rotate the image, move the players and the ball, view it as a full screen image and use the scribble board. There is a key at the bottom of the page which tells you what each line represents. At any time you can change the sharing options of your session. You can keep it to yourself, share with your colleagues in your club library or open it to the whole community. Sharing as a public session means you can pass the session to non-members via Facebook, Twitter or email via this link. Thank you for watching the sportsessionplanner.com introductory video for members. We hope that this has given you all the information that you need to get the best out of your membership. Don't forget if you need further information, have any questions or wish to give us feedback then we would love to hear from you. Go to the contacts page and you will find our email and contact details there.